BJP was detained after reaching Malda town. The team comprising BJP MPs SS Aluwalia, Bupendra Yadav and B.D. Ram was asked by party president Amit Shah to visit the violence hit area and submit a report. As soon as the team reached Malda railway station, police detained it. In Malda town, mob violence erupted last Sunday with mob burning down a police station and also several shops following alleged comments by a right-wing leader in UP. The team was asked to submit its report to the BJP president after visiting the violence hit area. The Home Ministry has asked West Bengal government to submit a report on the violence. Home Minister Rajnath Singh too is likely to visit Malda and Kalyachak on 18th of this month. Snehasi Sur is joining us from Kolkata to get us more on that. Snehasi, you've so just shown a brief introduction as to what are the developments in Malda in West Bengal. You give us the details first. This moment at the VIP room at the Malda <coughs> railway station, as you have already said, that as soon as the three MPs, Vupendra Jadar, B.V. Ram and S.S. Alu, Alia, Surinder Singh Alu Alia, who is from West Bengal, they arrived in Gold Express at Malda on the way to Kaliachok, the spot of the violence where violence erupted last week. They were detained and the district uh, the superintendent of police and the district magistrate, both of them went to the uh, railway station early morning and as soon as they arrived, they were taken to the VIP room and they are told not to proceed farther and the discussions and negotiations are going on. The Honourable MPs have said that they have come at the direction of the higher authorities of the party and they are supposed to give a report. But the district administration is uh, uh, apprising them that uh, going there may be uh, not possible or may be uh, not conducive as the situation is not uh, that calm for, the, for three MPs to visit there as a in the high dose of violence erupted uh, last week over uh, a speech and a statement and the uh, lot of areas were uh, set on fire including the vehicle of the border security force and the state bus and uh, the lone BJP MLA of the state assembly Samik Bhattacharya who also wanted to go and visit the spot uh, last week were also prevented not only prevented but detained and uh, uh, taken under police custody and he was also not allowed to go. So now it is to be seen that whether the MPs um, take a second hand uh, information from the district headquarters or try to proceed further or Snail what sees. actually the district administration does. Yes, yes uh, we've told our viewers that violence erupted last week on alleged statements and uh, uh, wordings of the of a leader in Uttar Pradesh. Uh, and also we've seen that this three-member team has been detained. Now, I would want you to give us more updates on any reaction or any statement which has been put forth by the state, gov state government. Any particular stand taken by the government, state government there? No, no, not, not uh, yet. Uh, anything from the state government has been um, issued uh, on this connection. But uh, they have just arrived early in the morning and they have been prevented. So three MPs, they have been prevented, mm -hmm. but nothing has come from the state government site, uh, apart from the district administration, they must have taken uh, the decision and they must have taken instructions from the higher authorities and they must mm. be uh, in touch with the state level authorities in the home ministry uh, right. or in the home department of the state. All right, Snesis, thank you so much for joining us and giving us those details.